Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today is kind of an exciting day. So it is Monday the 4th of November and it is the day that we're going to look at some cats to adopt. Um, sadly, and like a week ago today, not gonna cry, okay. Sadly, like a week ago today, um, we had to put down my cat Squeak. Mm, not gonna cry. Literally, I'm not joking. When I take the camera off of me, I can say it, but I just can't say it when the camera is on me. We're getting new cats because unfortunately, a week ago, we had to put down my cat Squeak. You might have seen him in some videos. I know he was on my room tour. He was on my bed at the end. So that's the reason why we're going to look um, and hopefully adopt. And we thought maybe we should wait till after Christmas to go adopt a cat. Um, but it's been awful. It's so like quiet in the house. Um, and I don't like being alone without a cat. But yeah, so I've lived 22 years and I've always had a cat and now we don't and it's just lonely so we want to get some more cats. Anyways, yeah, so we bought everything that we need um, and I can do a video. Just let me know down in the comments below if you're like getting new cats, if you're not sure what you should get for them. Uh, I figured I'd take you guys along today and maybe vlog like the entire experience um, if you're getting new cats so that if you're like looking to get a new cat. Um, you can keep, see kind of how we've done it. I've had five cats over my life. Five? Five, and then we had my brother's cat stay here too, so technically six. But yeah, so I think we know how to like do the whole cat thing pretty well. I'll take you along today. We'll, you know, introduce them all if we end up getting cats today. Um, and then I think I'll also vlog um, like the first week of having them. And, like if like seeing how they situate and everything um yeah i will see you when we go to the paint society and just a friendly reminder adopt don't shop rescue animals please which one's this one right here so that is nibbles oh, um cute. came in the summer um, Hi. Her and her mother were co-mothering kittens, so they, her mother and her had kittens, and they were mothering both sets of kittens. Oh, he's bigger than I thought. I know, he's huh? So I don't think he's going to let me touch him today. Hi, Fig. I know. So, yeah. But she is a great cat. Yeah, I'm sure she is. Well, Fig is a very cat friendly, so I don't necessarily think you have. No? I don't know, but I, I'm really liking this one. Hey. Yeah. Hi. Look at that. Oh, oh, I just. It's okay. I'm gonna go back over by Fig just to. Hi. Yeah, I know you're not a very people person. Nibbles, you will get a home. So there's this one right here that we're liking. And we don't know anything about. Oh, hi. Oh, yeah. And then Fig is very antisocial. But this one is getting around. I'm not following us. Hmm? Nope. No, I'm not. Okay. okay. Well, don't do it when he's on the stairs, too, no, when he has nowhere else to go. Hi, Fig! Hi, Fig! He did yeah. scratch me, but nothing awful. Oh, now this gray one's over Ming Ming, Mom. Oh. <laughs> he has urinary issues. She. she has urinary issues, so we can't get her. Because nice. we have had that. Hi. What? What'd you say? Wait. Hi. What'd you say? It's like, okay. And he's really cute. The thing is really good when he's on here tonight. He's Bella! Where's Bella? Fig!
So we're thinking Fig and Bella. Are you going to give her name as Bella? I don't know. She kind of looks like a Bella. Like, I wouldn't be opposed to Bella, but I'm also, I'm also going to see if maybe other people, if they watch this video, have suggestions. Bella? You are just a... You are just and then a thick. Bell. And I, I. Yes, you are. Yes, you're old. You'll be, you'll be smart. Uh, maybe. Yeah. So, it is 6:30 now. Um. Oh, poor fig. Yeah. And so we've got two cats. <laughs> um, we've got Belle here, which I don't know if you can see her. Um, and then we've got poor Fig. So, Fig was like the shyest of the shyest cats. Like, like don't touch me, shy. Um, but we want to give him a home because shy cats deserve a home too. And because that's probably deterrent from people getting him and that's not a deterrent from us getting him. <laughs> Uh, so yeah, you can have two to three years old. Yeah, so they're both two to three years old, which is the youngest I've ever had that I remember. So I'm excited. Um, and yeah, we're not sure. I think Fig might just stay Fig because it's such like a unique. It just name. fits him. But we're not sure about Belle yet. So when she is out, I will show you her and see if like what you guys think. They're doing a happy dance at the Watertown Humane Society right now. Yeah, the Watertown Humane Society. This is where they are. This is them. They are doing the happy dance. And they, when we expressed their interest in Fig, I think they were like very happy. They're obviously like trying to like let us like down easy that he wasn't going to be a nice cat, but that didn't stop us. Um, because Fig has been there since he was six weeks old and he's now like probably close to three years so he's been there a long time and we want to yeah um it, i mean it didn't take her as long as i thought it would no and she had to give him a booster shot and she had to microchip him yeah so um but we're excited and we'll, i'll show you guys where they are gonna be when we get home because we're gonna put them in our office the office um just to like make sure that they're so we're excited and i will show you them okay hello so it's like an hour later now it's like 7 30 7 45 we're home um right now so we're just gonna keep the cats in this room um this office room um for now just to make them more like have a safe spot so we're just getting it ready if, if it gets, oh. see i think hold on i'm gonna record them Oh, Fig. Hi. So there's Fig. He's the one that doesn't like people. <laughs> I touched his, his and head. And my mom touched him earlier. Don't, sh like, blind him. Nope. Blindside him. Hi, Figgy. Hi, Figgy. We've kind of... My mom wants to name him Jack. She named her first cat Joel. So we're not going on this train again. We have to go for a manly type name. No, but... I'm not sure if she's, I, like, I kind of want her to be Luna. Hi. I think she fits a Luna because she's gray and white, like yeah. the moon. Yeah. Like, you know, I think she fits, like, the name moon. Maybe just moon. moon. <laughs> Star? No. Moon, moon, moon something? We're trying to think of names. So I'm once sure they're out, I'll show you them, show you them. But he is definitely more, like, a beach color, like tan. And she is gray and white. And fun fact, this is the first female cat we've ever had yeah period <laughs> i mean my very first cat when i was a little girl was a female okay that doesn't really i've happen. never had a female cat and the last one she had was like 50 years ago <laughs> okay like 30 years 35 40 years 40 ago let's <laughs> turn not to give away your age 40 years ago um but yeah so mom you gotta go do the cat litter okay. so here's here are here are them she i think we've already kind of She's got a heart-shaped nose. I know, that's what the Amy said. Yeah. She has a heart-shaped nose. Like, we were looking at Luna for her, um, and we were trying to find, like, astrological names that fit him. But, like, all the ones that fit him are, like, female names. And not that you can't have a female, like, my brother named his cat Winnie, like, and he's a male. So you can, like, do whatever you want, but they just haven't fit him. So, cat litter in here. Cat one, cat two. Um, we put this bed underneath here because it's kind of a little bit more like they can be hidden if they want hidden. Comes right out and goes and hides. It's okay. 
It's okay, Fig. He was scoping out where he was going to go because he knew exactly where he was going to go. Hi. <laughs> She's like, hi, I'm just chilling. Yeah, I know. That's Fig. It, that's 100% Fig because oh, I was looking yeah. at Hi, Belle. I'm going to leave this here. Yeah, so in case he wants to go back in there. Hey, Fig. It's okay, Belle. Pumpkin. Hey, Belle. Hey, Fig. Hi. I wonder if they, like, recognize each other. Yes, yeah, a strange room, isn't it, Belle? She's slinking. I knew, I knew Maybe you should them. move further away from the litter so that they can see the litters there. <gasps> I knew one of them would go over there. They're fine together. Yep. Uh -huh. we, it, it was such a good idea to get two in the same place. Yep. It's, I'm smart once in a while. Yeah. Hey, Vic. Don't move. Hey, Vic. Look at them slinking. She's like, okay. Can you oh, maybe move over there? I'm, yeah, I want them to be able to see the litter. Right. Look at her. It's okay. It's okay. Hmm? Come check it out. There's comfort with each other, so which is fine. Hi. Yeah. Hi, Belle. Look at my hand out, just in case she... Good morning, everyone. Um, so it is the next morning. It's like 6.30 right now, so that's why I look like this. Um, oh, I can't sit here. Okay. But yeah, it's the next morning. Um, the cats are doing okay. <laughs> um, Belle over here is doing just fine. She was just out and about and being loud. Hi, Belle. I think she's chilling now because she just ate. You can see. Poor fig. <laughs> Poor guy, I don't know if you can see him. Hold on, when I zoom in enough, you'll be able to see his head. But he is just like, not having it. He is laying underneath. <laughs> Blanket. Poor guy. <laughs> um, I don't know if it's just because he's cold or because he's scared and that's a safety thing. But we did put out like some soft food for them to hopefully eat. Um, but yeah, so I think Belle will be like completely fine. Um, I think it will obviously be a little bit of work, but we expected that. Like, he doesn't like people, period. So we're not expecting him to be jumping out the walls anytime soon. And we'll probably do a name reveal. I'll probably do a name reveal in the next video. Um, I'm thinking about making them Instagrams or like a joint Instagram probably. It might be easiest to do a joint Instagram. And I also want to vlog um, like the entire thing, especially with Fig because he's so shy. So it's a little bit later and I'm just going to go check on the cats right now um, and I'll just vlog that a little bit. And then I'm probably just gonna end the vlog. Hi. <gasps> Hi, and now you can see her and what she looks like. Hi. Yeah. Oh, aren't you so cute? Oh, yes. Isn't she just the prettiest cat? I've never had a girl cat before. 
So this is exciting. Oh, but see, like I kind of advanced on her too quickly. Hi. Yeah. And like you gotta be very like gentle with how you like go and rub her, cause like if you move too quickly, she kind of freaks out. See, like when you move, Mr. Fig over here. In there, he's just my. Hi. Um. So we were thinking about it, and we're thinking about keeping his name Fig because we're not sold on like any of the names. They're not really like clicking, and the more we think about it, the more we just feel like Fig fits. Um. And like we don't like Belle. Um. We I we just don't think it fits her very well. Um, but I think we really like Nova, um, but I think it's still between Nova, Rhea, and Luna out of all of them. Um, so let me know in the comments below what you guys like, um, and, you know, we'll decide. So, with that said, I think I'm gonna end the video here. Um, if you did enjoy it, please give a big thumbs up. Make sure you do subscribe down below and comment down below if you did subscribe so I can thank you. Um, yeah, I'm excited to do more videos on like these cats document their like journey um, over like the next however long. So thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.